Harry packs 324 kilograms of sweets. In 5 kilograms bags and 3 kilograms bags. Harry has 4 more 5 kilograms bags. Then 3 kilograms bags of sweets. How many bags of sweets does he have? Question 14. Harry packs 322 k I'm oh, sorry, 324 kg of sweets in 5 kg bags and 3 kg bags. Harry has 4 more 5 kg bags and then 3 kg bags of sweets. How many bags of sweets does he have all together? So when we read the question, um, there's actually extra for 5 kg bags, right? So let's get rid of those first. Okay, the extra 4 bags of 5 kg. So 4 times 5 kg, that is 20 kg. Now, if I were to remove this extra, the new total that I have will be 20 kg less. Which is 304 kg. Okay, so 304 kg. Um, I can now use grouping where I have one each because there's no more no more extra quantity, right? Which means no more extra bags from the 5 kg. I have equal number of bags now. So when I have equal number, do not take the mass and divide by two. Uh. Equal number means equal quantity, not, not equal mass. So I have one of each, one of 5 kg and one of 3 kg bag of sweets. Okay, this is grouping. Here, the total mass I have is 304 kg. So in one group, I need to find the total mass as well. Okay, let's just indicate here there were extra four 5 kg bags. 20 kg. Okay, so in one group, I need to find the total mass since I have the, the total mass here. Okay, I have total mass here. So I need to find total mass in one group first. So that will give us 8 kg. How many 8 kgs are there in 304? So I'm finding number of groups. Take 304 divided by 8. That do a long division. This will give us 38 groups. So how many bags of sweets does he have all together? Uh, 38 groups. If every group has 2 bags, then 38 groups means that I'll take 38 times 2 for the total number of bags in 38 groups. Then remember we have this extra 4 bags. You need to add them back to get the answer, the number of bags of sweets in total. All right, so answer is 80. 80 bags of sweets, huh? not 80 kg.